Yo, what is good, my anime people? What is good? Honestly, it was a interesting episode to say the least, but I can understand why a lot of people are not as thrilled to watch this show. This show reminds me of a ridiculous amount of Kill a Kill, where it just felt like everything that was going on was just in its own world. It was just doing whatever it wanted to, however it wanted to, and it really didn't coincide with a lot of um, a lot of what you would expect to happen in an anime. I guess you could say, like Kill a Kill was just something of a wild show that just could do whatever it wanted, however it wanted, and it would have fun while doing it. So. This show feels a little bit more serious, like it's down and trying to make us feel some type of way about everything uh, when it comes down to just certain characters and the way the growth and potential is becoming. Uh, For example, the kid with the glasses has a lot of potential and whatnot, but he keeps doing all this shady stuff. That makes you more or less wonder if he's just going to end up becoming the villain at the end of the day instead of actually someone to help us and defeat these demons. Because all of this, like, continuous grind to figure out, you know, uh, what's so good about demons or, like, just, just trying to experiment on them in general, right? These are the types of things that are huge red flags, in my opinion. He's continuously taking body parts to uh, the scientist to have it examined and to have it actually put in a position uh, where he hasn't really explicitly said what all this experimenting is for. Like, are you trying to make a stronger being? Are you trying to, you know, become better than you already are like what is the point of doing this if at the end of the day you're only going to get so far right in the case of you're going to be making a demon you're going to be trying to uh maybe steal the demon's power for yourself like are you trying to unlock the seal to let more demons you know like there's only so much that could happen and because his character is putting himself in a position for us to already practically know uh you know where his position is going to lie it doesn't really do much for me in particular unfortunately so that's kind of what i'm looking forward to now is if there's something they can do to bring my attention to this kid and even care about what he's doing with uh all of these different body parts and different stuff like that like is there going to be a time where that actually means something or are we in a position where it's just it is what it is at this point so that's what i'm curious about mostly the show is entertaining the new guy that they just introduced well he's not new to the show but he's new to our crew some of our crew members and He's clearly one of the first people to ever be trained by the old hag. And just seeing his reaction to knowing that he might have to go back, he's like, do you hate me? You must hate me. (laughs) No, that that stuff had me dying, though. So very, very uh, curious to see where all this is going to go and be headed. But yeah, I honestly think it has potential, even if the animation style is not for everybody. I think some people will still be able to get like a nice little nice little something something out of this show. So don't give up on it yet. Join me in watching it if you have to. But regardless, I hope you all have an amazing day, night, evening, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace.